What's going on everybody? It's Loader Jandal here, coming at you with another Destiny video. It is Friday, November 13th, and if it's Friday, it means it's Zur Day, and he has arrived at the tower. He's over here in the south, right in the hangar, right next to the ships, as you can see. Hey Zur! I never will understand why your face looks so weird, but funny. Okay! Let's see what his merchandise is for today. We have Crest of Alpha Lupi for the Titan. 90 intellect out of 110. Here are the perks. Keeper of the Pack, revive fallen teammates and you revive faster. And supers generate an extra orb. Increases strength. Increased intellect. So... Pulse Rifle Ammo Increase, Shotgun Ammo, Arc Recovery, and Arc Armor. So this is a Striker's Crest of Alpha Loopy, if you just want to call it that. Next up, we have the Young Ahamkara Spine for the Gunslinger. 55 Discipline, with an Intellect Boost as well. Next, we have Fastball, increases your gr grenade throw distance, and Impact Induction, where bonus grenade energy is gained on melee hits. We have Scout Rifle Loader and Shotgun Loader. Reload speed increases to the Scout Rifle and Shotguns, respectively. Next, we have the Warlock's Obsidian Mind. This is for all you Void Walkers out there. With that has 34 intellect and 35 strength. We have the intellect and strength increases. Ashes to assets where you gain bonus super energy on grenade kills. And then second thoughts. Bonus super energy from special weapon kills on minions of the darkness. And then we have infusion. Replenishes health each time you pick up an orb of light. This honestly guys is an ideal PvP build of sorts. I say ideal in my book. Especially if you like to use your uh, your energy drain attacks. My opinion, my opinion only. For our engram, this time we have the exotic gauntlets, 19 strange coins, and our legacy is a chest armor. For our curios, we have the emerald coil, stealth drive, not to be confused with the stealth drive that you have on a ship that gets destroyed. Heavy ammo synth, three of coins, and glass needles. And then our material exchange, to be expected. So, for a new player, mm, I'd probably give this guy's rating, for a rating, maybe a 7 out of 10. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe an 8 at the farthest. It depends on how much you guys manage to grab with these back in the start. As a veteran, maybe a 6 or 7. It's it's kind of hard to, to really say. I mean, I don't recall these being sold before. I'm sure this has been found a lot, though. This may be. With the Hunters, there's a lot of gauntlets. So, I mean, who am I to say? The Obsidian Mind. There's quite a few. There's a some warlock helmets so I mean you know with the random I'd say it's it's good definitely is it the greatest mm, I don't know I can't say so that wraps up this destiny video with Zua Day I hope you guys enjoyed what, me going over the equipment each piece of equipment individually and as always I will catch you in my next destiny mission peace